Captain first, sit down on the bench over here. Chewie and uh, Pocket Chew, nominate your first races, please. I guess I'll go first. I'm, I'm, I'm sacrificing you first. <laughs> <laughs> Big up Tesco. Yes, Nims. I know. <laughs> right, here we go. <gasps> oh, I was going to say. <laughs> right. Everybody set. Everybody good? Everybody can see where I am? When oh, I yeah. say, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to use the surprise emote like this when I say, and I'm also going to say go at the same time. Whichever you see or hear first, because I know there's a lag. So, whichever you see or hear first, you go on that. Okay? Everybody clear on the rules and what to do? Yeah, that sounds great. Woo. Okay. Make sure you Round go in one. the box. I will be watching. <laughs> Three, two, one, a go! Oh, look at all pocket shoes. Pocket shoes. <laughs> go, Chewy, go. Hey. It's a pocket to win. First point. <laughs> not bad, not bad, not bad. Well done, don't worry. Don't worry, Chewy's teams. Three rounds of this. Three rounds. Nominate your second racer. Nominate your second racer. Also, Marcus, in the chat, who do you reckon is going to win the 100 meter dash? Overall, we already saw Pocket Chew claiming the first victory, but are their team gonna win this overall? Let us know. Let us know in the chat. Okay. Who's up next? Stella, you're up next. All right, oh, I'll no. Here for two <laughs> is, it, is it a good time? Is yeah, yeah, yeah. Allowing? yeah. Is he busy, like playing with a poster tube or something? Nice. Look at that. Right. Della Ganache is babysitting and playing Animal Crossing at the same time. Winning at life. <laughs> right, here we go. Three, two, one, a go! Go on. Oh, it's a false start, dude. Oh, there we go. Look, oh, it's an easy victory. It's an oh, easy good victory. For skip points. <laughs> it's another easy victory. Chewy, what's did going we, did, on? Did we do it? I'm not sure. <laughs> <laughs> it's it, it's a tough race out there. <laughs> All right, don't worry, don't worry. We've still got another race to go. Uh, let's see. Uh, one of you two on uh, Chewy's team will have to go again. And uh, Pocket Chew's third racer. Let's go. Let us see. 2-0. Two 2-0. Nil. Two nil. Here we go. Three, two, one, a go! <laughs> oh, oh, oh! It, it, they've messed it up. They've messed it up. <laughs> I think it's don't the worry, rain. Guys, don't worry, there's uh, there's you sleeping in the rain. Yeah, don't worry, there's lots of <laughs> there's lots of uh, other rounds to go, so don't worry about that. Okay, you guys, follow me. Uh, we're heading up this way. All right, so we're gonna go to the next one. This one is an obstacle course, uh, but it's uh, fishing wise. What's gonna happen is. You're gonna run up the up here. You're gonna scoot on through the tiki torches, hop on over the uh, uh, the uh, potholes, past the tiki torch. Then you're gonna grab some fish bait, throw the fish bait into the water, catch a fish. Once you've caught a fish, you're gonna head on back through the tiki torches, over the pothole, past the last tiki torch, and then when you see a red 2020 at the base. You need to show off your fish. Once you've shown off your fish, your next team member can go. All right? Cool. Does that make any sense? <laughs> That's perfect. I'm going to go grab okay. my food controller while we wait for this flight. Oh, okay. I'm getting serious. Bro, <laughs> controller. Chewy, what's going on? That's what we're doing, too. You know, we were just yeah, playing with the... Okay. <laughs> I, I did hear that more shade of... I did that race with your Joy-Con. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go, Animal Crossing World. You got fans in the chat. You got fans in the chat. But Pocket Chew is everyone saying she's going to win this. Everyone's <laughs> saying on the boat. Come on, guys. Let's see. Well, let's we're see bringing in we're... our ringer right here. Sergio, he knows what's up. Okay. He's going to change everything. 
Yeah, just, uh, I do, I do love that his name is Freshly Delivered Friend. <laughs> Beautiful. You really need Beautiful. Custom. Custom made friend. <laughs> Sergio's the game changer. Oh, the chat is the chat speaking. He's the guy. He's the MVP. Is he coming in to change it up? The secret weapon. Sergio, the secret weapon, yeah? Okay, we, we shall see. Big talk here. Sergio, I'm like, did I get secret, secret weapon? Oh, oh yeah, you got your you got your pro controller. <laughs> <laughs> the power's in the hats, really. It's the hats that do it. Ah, okay, right. Let me go fetch Sergio. You guys stay where you are. Uh, you can. <laughs> Melly, have you got enough fish bait? Yes, there's lots at the top. Oh, sweet, perfect. Okay. Let sure, me go back fetch Sergio. The rain drips off the side. It's like a cone, so it's like perfect. Um, yeah, we're immune to rain. Streamlines the rain. Immune to rain. <laughs> <laughs> Makes right, our hats look shinier. Let's see. Oh, oh no, he's gone. <laughs> Where's Sergio? Is he in the voice chat? <laughs> Where is he gone? He should be here. He's not, he's not at the airport. He's not at the airport. We've lost him. Do you want me to go find him? Uh... <laughs> <laughs> you guys stay here. Sergio! Oh, there he is. Marco. Where are you? <laughs> oh. Alright. Uh, over here. There we go. <laughs> they need like a foghorn thing for Animal Crossing, I reckon. Like a little foghorn thing to like say, yo, this direction. Or, you know what I mean? I want Find My Friends app on the Nook phone so you can see where people are on the island. Yes. Nook phone, Find My Friends. Yeah. Is what, is what is Sergio's gone AWOL. I know. Everyone was everyone was picking up Sergio, but then man got lost. <laughs> so I don't know. <laughs> I, I don't know. I don't know. He's supposed to be the MVP, but we can't Hello, find Gigo. him. Have a look at the um the Chu Crew Pogachu Twitch chat because I've I've said something there that it's gonna get us ready for this. A little okay. bit of strats. Am I allowed They're to do ready. that? They got the oh. strats ready on their stream. <laughs> there we go, here's Sergio. Got it. Got it, got the message. The information. He's, he's, he's there available. he is. Alright, Sergio, this way. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Right. Now, everybody clear on the rules for this one? Do you need another explanation? Um, yes. Okay. <laughs> so, this one, start down here uh, on the benches. Alright? But And then you run up here, scoot past the tiki torches, you jump over the pothole, past the other tiki torch, then you grab some fish bait. Once you grab the fish bait, throw it in the water, catch a fish. Any fish will do. Once you've caught a fish, come back. You can't come back until you've caught a fish. Once you've caught a fish, come all the way back here to where it says 2020. Stand in the 2020 and show off your fish that you caught. Once you've done that, your next team member can go. Okay? Everyone clear? Sounds good. Okay, got yeah. it. All right then, let's do it. A uh, bit of advice, might be worth having your fishing rod out already. Up to you, up to you. You don't have to, up to you though. All right, oh look at Sergio, he's, he's coming barefooted. He's, he's the guy, he's the guy. Barefoot runner. Barefoot Sergio, yes, the chat are loving it. All right, Marcus, who's gonna win this one? Let's see, Fisherman's Rush. <laughs> Once all three teams are back and all of them have shown off their fish, that team wins, okay? It's 3-0 to Pocket Chew so far. Pocket Chew, Pocket Chew streamer laughing. <laughs> <laughs> this is our yeah. comeback. Come you on, better Chewy. watch out. <laughs> Come on, Chewy. This is my dream. It's, it's not just this stream. There's other streams. <laughs> here we go. No, I said this is my dream. All right, here we go. Three. Oh, sorry. How, do we do we know an order that you're running in, guys? Yeah, he's going. order. Going. Sweet. Should Everyone I go knows. first? I guess yeah, you, you, lead, you lead the charge. I'll go second. Yeah, sounds good. I'll go first, and then maybe right, you, you Justin, the and then Sergio. Yeah. Do I'll we start here at the 2020? Oh, right. people, people, <laughs> people calling for Jimmy. It's 50-50 in the boats. It's 50-50. <laughs> oh, All okay. right, here we go. Three, two. One, go! Go on. Oh, they're scooting on by. Nice. 
Doing a good job so far. We've got the bait. Nice jump bomb pocket chew there. Straight into the water. Come on, come on. Get that fish bait in it. Oh, we've already got fish out. It's all about the positioning. Get that positioning right. Oh. Get that positioning right, guys. Come on. Pocket chew, what's going on? That's it. Get the fish bait in there. Oh, have we got something? Oh, Chewy's team's got something. Yes, Chewy's Chewy. Got something. <laughs> yes. Back. They're coming Get back. The Run back. There we go, there we go, there we go. Big points for this one. That's it, over the hole, scoop past the Tiki Torch, stand in the 2020, and then show off your fish. Let's see it. All right, there we go, 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 go. <laughs> oh, Sergio, oh, Sergio come doing? back. Sergio, where are you going? You're supposed to be MVP. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking you, she's got fish. Finally, go, 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 go. <laughs> Make sure you're at the water's edge. Make sure you're at the water's edge. It's so hard. Oh, there we go. We purposely put it up here because fishing uh, above you is probably it is hard. It's the hardest. That's why we did it. It like is. That. Oh, it's, it's we got it's fish. Rocks, isn't it? Chewy's team's got. Oh, they got a big got fish. Them. They got a big fish. Come on back. Come on back. There we go. Nice. I think Chewy's team oh, might have <laughs> Go on, I think the chat might be wrong. Oh, let's see, let's see it, let's see go, it. Sergio, go, 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 go. There we go, there we go. It's the MVP. Go, go. It's the MVP. There he is. Come on, Danny, come on. Oh, big fish, Sergio. Sergio, we're expecting an oar fish. We're expecting an oar fish. Go, go, go. Come on. Oar fish. <laughs> oar fish, Sergio, come on. See the camp. Oh, see the yes. camp. <laughs> no, Sergio, the positioning's all off. The positioning's all off. Oh, oh, Becky Chew's team might be getting it. Oh no, Becky Chew's team might be Come on, kid guy. Oh, kid guy, he's got his fishing rod out. Go. Oh, Sergio's got something. Oh, it's a bass. It's a bass. It's not quite the oar fish, but it'll do. It'll do. Come on, Becky Oh, back. no. Come on, Yes. Back. Sergio. Go, go, go. No, Come on, Becky Justin, move. Oh, let's see, let's see. Show it off, show it off, show it off. Hey. Oh. <laughs> Got it. What a great race. Three <laughs> points. That was entirely my fault. To Chewie's team. They brought it back. <laughs> they brought it back. Well done. Good. Have a chance. Well done. Right. Uh, follow me, guys. We're going to need your ladder for this one. All right. How are you guys with math? No. Pretty good. Uh, <laughs> Hopefully. Uh, up this way, up this way. All right. uh, up and to the right, and then we're going to climb up here. Barefoot Sergi. He's already got nicknames in the chat. <laughs> 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 right. Here we go, guys. Oh this my. is quick math. What's going to uh. happen is, Melly or me, or, uh, one of us is going to shout out a sum. But the sum is going to be like four peaches now on the floor you can see there's the peaches are worth different amounts the, the individual fruits are worth different amounts peaches worth 100 oranges are worth 200 and cherries 300 so four peaches would be 400 okay what you have to do one t uh so one person from each team will have to jump and land on the correct answer when you jump and you land you will be able to see the amount that each coin is worth don't pick it up. Just stand on the correct answer. First person <laughs> to stand on the correct answer wins. Melly knows where all the coin amounts are. You guys yeah, don't. Do. But you can use a bit of strategy. You can try and memorize where certain numbers are. Or you can communicate with your team and let them know where to jump to. Oh, man. Okay? Can we, can we just... Everybody clear? Um, oh, jeez. I got, I, got I got a bit lost. So it's... um. Can you, can you one more time real quick? Yeah, yeah, sure. So <laughs> it's quick Do an example one. So for example, uh, I'd say uh, two oranges. Two oranges will be 400 coins. So I would have to jump and try and find the coin that matches 400. So when I'm jumping on the platform, it will tell you how much that platform is worth. I have to find 400, but the other team is also going to be jumping at the same time to try and find that exact number. So. Okay. 400 is over here so the, if i landed here first melly would give me a point for that okay, yeah. okay. First, first team to get to the right one wins quick maths in it 
<laughs> so I don't need to breathe back, I just need to get to that number because you just know where they are. You don't need to get to that number, you don't yeah. need to put it up or don't anything. Pick up, don't pick up Damn. the money, it's just that you need to be on the right block. What if I have the money? Might want to use This is where you want to use the, the team chat for this one, is because if you know that, for example, the platform on the left in the middle might be a certain number, and that sum comes up and it matches that number, you might want to tell your team member where to go. It's up to you. Or let them figure it out for themselves. Okay. There's going to be five sums. Alright? <laughs> five points up for grabs. Who's going first for each team? Uh, How good are you at math? I'm pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, you got this. All right. I'll, I'll go first, hoping that it's an easy one, because it's the first one. Yeah, yeah, Isabella, that's actually a good idea. We should call this Maths Ninjas. Because <laughs> we're hopping around. All right. Everybody ready? Everybody clear? Yes. yes. Okay, yeah. There we go. This is it. First round. First sum is... Two cherries. Go. <laughs> Melly, you tell us who's that put in the right one. Yeah, I will do. I'm watching. Oh, we can block each other as well. Nice, pocket two's blocking. No. <laughs> no. Why it's the pocket two's team. There we go. Nice. There we go. Maths. Next sum. Quick maths. <laughs> Three cherries. Go. Oh. Three go, cherries. Justin. <laughs> That's <laughs> nine hundred. <laughs> <laughs> Barefoot Sergi, get back! <laughs> oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh, I got blocked again. again. You got it? Yeah. Oh, we're What's getting blocked. Nice. I don't know. Pocket two again. Pocket two again. Okay. Two points to pocket two there. All right, Sergio, you, you got this. Don't let it leave. Let me know. Sally, you can do this. Okay. Here we go. Four oranges. Uh, Look at Sergi. Right. Man like Sergi. I have Sergi. no idea where that is. <laughs> bottom right? Go down? Did someone say bottom right? Is it bottom right? Did someone say bottom No, is that a trap? Are you- <gasps> Hey! Who is it? Oh. Uh, I told you. I told you, you it was bottom right. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> you, you actually gave that. We're on the <laughs> wrong <laughs> side. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Sergio, what's going on? You're supposed to be the MVP! <laughs> he is the MVP, <laughs> just for which team? <laughs> Alright, here we go. One peach, go! Oh, I think middle, that's middle. me. That's right. I think I've done it. Melly? Yeah. Uh, Melly's gone. Sorry, sorry, I'm multitasking. One peach. Yeah. Right. It's, 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 it's pocket two again? It's pocket two again, it's a two crew. Oh, yeah. No. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, what? Yes, is... Oh, my God. <laughs> wow. Okay, don't worry, don't worry. Don't worry. Last one, last one. There we go. Quick math. You got this, Justin. On, Quick math. <laughs> there we go. Two peaches, go. Oh my gosh, this is so intense. Ding, ding, ding. Oh, right, who's that? Who is it? Ooh. There you go. Who is it, Millie? Oh, it's another Chukri. It's no. a <laughs> Wow. Oh my gosh. Wow. You're on the wrong side of all of this these. This is why I brought you guy and Della. I, I, I knew. <laughs> Eight, three. Sergio, go. When we get to okay. the trivia, though, you guys are going to wipe the floor with us during trivia. Yeah, there's trivia. There is. There we go. Follow me. Uh oh, is it coming? You're gonna need your ladders again. Well done, Pocket Choose team. Well done. Got the lead. Eight three, but they can claw it back. Uh, hold on. Let's see if we got. Oh, we might have time for musical chairs. We might have time for that. <gasps> let's try that over this way. I think we might have time. We might have time. All right, here we go. Oh man, I'm gonna listen out now. <laughs> <laughs> So, musical chairs, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to play a song on the stereo over here, one of KK's fantastic beats. What you guys got to do, you got to run around in a circle in an anti-clockwise or, or clockwise direction. I will let you know. When the music stops, I'm going to shout out a color of a chair. 
Once I do that, you need to sit down on that color. Teams sitting on the correct colors get a point. If you're sitting on the incorrect color, you lose a point. Okay? Oh no. Do we have to sit down? <laughs> you don't have to sit down. Ah, do we lose the point if we don't sit down? But you want to sit down because you want to get the points. Okay. Mm. Yeah, there you we... lose a point if you sit on the wrong colour chair. Because that's how okay. we did it earlier. Right, okay. Yeah. On the colour chair that Inel says. Alright, okay. <laughs> Two seconds, guys, while I prepare the tunes over here. Okay, guy, are you just gonna are there. you just gonna sit on the red one and just not gonna move? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let me know if you can hear this music. Melly said the DMB one, let's try that. Yeah, drum and bass. You guys hear it? Okay, running around in a clockwise direction. Let's go! Oh, that's not clockwise. Oh, wait, that <laughs> is clockwise. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Where's Barefoot Sergi? <laughs> there he Where, is. Where's Barefoot Sergi? <laughs> he's in, he's in, he's in. He's there, in. He is, there he is, there he is, there he is. The chat won Barefoot Sergi. <laughs> Hi. White! Oh. <laughs> Oh, we went for the same oh, one! Oh, yeah! yeah. <laughs> that was beautiful! Wait a piece. Wait Look at a piece. That. Not bad, not bad. Next round. <laughs> Anti clockwise! Ooh. This is a tune as well. It's a shame that we can't listen to it all the way through. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I mean. I got it this morning and I was like, this is a banger. A little bit advice. You might want to spread out a little bit just in case, innit? Alright, just in case. Yeah, bunching just is no case. one's friend. <laughs> Social distancing, guys. Yeah, Come on. Exactly. <laughs> Come on. This is a banger. White. Oh, oh no. Oh, oh, yes. 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 Wow. You guys slid in with the steel. You guys are good at sitting. Side side. Point each. Nice. Well right done. Clockwise. Good at it. <laughs> Time. You see that, chat? You see that? Sneak attack from Gig oh. Eye there. Well done. Well done, Gig Eye. Red! Ah. Oh. oh, yeah! Oh, the point of peace again! The point of peace again! Okay, not bad, not bad. Anti clockwise! <laughs> Stack! <laughs> Oh, oh, okay. oh, 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 yes. the point of peace. The point of peace. Point of peace again. <laughs> Anti clockwise. Uh, ooh. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? Remembering what anti clockwise I love how we all get confused by that every time. What? Uh, what? Oh, 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 Sergio's supposed to be the MVP. I oh, know, chat. I oh, know. We've not seen Sergio sit down yet. <laughs> I stole it from that time. Kind of. We were going for the same one. Do you want my shoes or my socks? I'll just Yeah, Sergio. What's going on? The chat are wondering what's happening with Sergio. Come on. MVP. We need to see it. Anti clockwise. Let's go. This is a rhythm, though. You like it, man. have time for uh, I'm trying to check we only have time for one question oh. so it's gonna have to be a big question okay 
Okay. Oh, well, I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna lose. <laughs> Make it easy. <laughs> Alright. Two seconds, guys. Justin, you know everything about Animal Crossing. Ah, uh, <laughs> I'm so scared, dude. Animal Crossing player in the hot seat. Stella, is that me? Do you want um, me to go too, or do you want to go? Yeah, definitely not me. <laughs> you should do it, Justin. Oh, sorry. Um, I already, oh gosh, all right. No, I <laughs> Pressure's on. I need pressure. And Isaac's just found a bowl. Go to go. <laughs> okay. I'm this terrified. Is... Why are you terrified? <laughs> this is... I, <laughs> I can't do this. <laughs> Fighting for that chair was enough for me. I'm basically dead. Nah. Can, I, can I test the bell? <laughs> yeah, of course you can. Nice. Nice. Now, <laughs> Pocket Chew has put, on, put over 200 hours into this game. 300. 300 oh. hours. 300 She's got nothing. <laughs> She's got nothing. <laughs> yeah? Chewie's team have an Animal Crossing podcast. They've got knowledge. <laughs> I got knowledge. I got but all the knowledge. Who has the best knowledge? Let's find out. Animal Crossing New Horizons has lots of new faces and lots of old faces. But there's three animals in Animal Crossing that were made unemployed for this one. Their names begin with the letter P. Who are they? Oh, Pikachu, Pikachu. I'm going to have to push you for an answer. <laughs> oh, you couldn't go. hear me. Sorry, I thought I was talking. Pelly, Pete, and... P... 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 Oh. P... Oh, oh. Can, how long can I... Ah. Oh, <laughs> Chewie's <laughs> team. Yeah, you can... You can yeah? I f oh, that doesn't sound like it because of a P, oh, oh. but it does, doesn't it's it? Phyllis, right? The last one? Yeah, yeah. What, what, what are they? Are they? I, I, so I'm, I'm gonna have to push up Chewie's team for an answer. So who? All three, what are they? Uh, Pete, Pelly, and Phyllis, if that's it, but I don't think they're in that's New Horizons, so, so... That's so it, you've got it, man. Did I, did I miss your question? <laughs> well, I'm done! <laughs> oh, <laughs> yay! <laughs> Even though you I got the three points... Unfortunately, it's not enough to win the game. No. <laughs> and the winners, the victors, are Pocket Chew's team! Woo! Well done, guys. Well done. Well done. Well done. It was tough. <laughs> it was tough. It got close, a few close calls. Man like Sergio came the MVP, but I think he let the team down. We, we wanted to see more Sergio. We wanted to see more Sergio. <laughs> You did guys, great, Sergio. Follow, <laughs> follow, follow me, guys. Follow me down here. <laughs> the secret. Well right, done, Pocket Chew. You have to take the picture without me because I just got disconnected. Oh, did you? Okay. Yeah. Oh, no. All oh, right, follow good. me down here, guys. Oh, no. She looks like she's just been... I think it's going to morph all of us down here anyway. Uh, yeah, there we go. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Mel got disconnected. We'll take a team yeah. photo without Melly. But well done, guys. Well done. I can done. Photoshop myself yeah, in. Yeah. It's fine. Yeah. <laughs> Pocket two, you were almost there with the with the Animal Crossing knowledge. You missed out, Phyllis. I know. I know. I'm hey, it's a hard silly. one. It's it, a hard I know how to spell the name as well. Now. I just, I, I guess, I didn't pay as much attention to her. She's quite the grumpy character, isn't she? Yeah, she is. Hey, yeah. Well, they all used to have jobs. Now they don't have jobs. <laughs> so sad. Portfolio justice. Oh, what are they Phyllis. doing now? <laughs> Corona Maybe, like... got them. Oh no! <laughs> no! 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 <laughs> you can't say that, Jaden. You can't say that. I like to think that they like elope, like Pete and Pelly, settled down somewhere. Uh, but uh, the chat are saying the player of the day is Barefoot Sergio. <laughs> <laughs> I'm willing to say that that's yeah that's that's good. That's good. I agree. Agreed. 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 Diamond says we call it Blackfoot around here. <laughs> he gets all the bells. He gets the bells. Ah, uh, right. Who's still left on the island? Is there anyone still left on the island? I'm alive. I'm I on the loading agree. screen. Oh, I'm back. Yeah, back. I'm loading. I'm loading. Yeah, I'm loading too. Wait, well done, guys. We'll take a nice little team photos right right here. Apologies, Melly's not here, unfortunately. But we'll get a nice picture and thank you guys for taking part. Thank you very much.
Uh, Chewie's team, do you have anything, any last parting words for the viewers that are watching? Anything you'd like to say? Anything you'd like to plug? It was uh, an honor to play against such great players. They were a tough competition, but we'll get them back next time. <laughs> we'll be back. We'll be back. Than we'll be back. I'm counting on that. I'm counting on that. <laughs> well done. And Pocket Shoes, do you have any last words at all for your team? Anything you'd like to say? Anything you'd like to say? Of course. Thank you so, so much for, for, for running this, you guys. Uh, Dalla and Giga, you're amazing. Thank you. you. You're sitting outstanding. It was it was great. And also, thank you so much to you, who, our opponents for all of your, your service in the Animal Crossing community. I am a big honor to play against you. And this was really fun and I'm very happy. Thank you. <laughs> no worries. And as I said, guys, uh, this is all in aid of helping out the NHS. You guys in the chat enjoyed uh, watching the Animal Crossing, especially this round. Make sure you donate. The link is in the chat. Thank you very much, you guys. I'm going to have to kick you off the island to get the new players on, unfortunately. But lovely playing with you. Lovely chatting with you. And I hope you guys had a good time as well. I'll see you Thanks later. Bye. 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 Bye, everyone. Bye. See ya. Thanks so much for playing, everyone. That was super fun. <laughs> Thanks. This was Thanks. awesome. I'm yeah, going to have no, to jump really out. Good. You and guys then... put a lot of effort into that. Uh, honestly, yeah. I, I now has been turning that island like he's been going like i've only got two rooms in my house he goes how have you, how have you <laughs> got a basement like I've, i said i'll tell you how you've been custom designing your entire island that's why you spend all your money on like stalls and i don't know <laughs> crazy stuff and not paying your nook loan that's how <laughs> <laughs> I feel like being able to see it. It's, it's, it's awesome. I, I want to see more of it. It's really cool. Um, well, you have to come over and just have a run around. That open, yeah, that's, it's yeah, super, yeah, it's yeah. Impressive. Yeah, that's that's open to anyone. Just just drop myself or I know a message, and um, we'll have a little tour party. So that we obviously just really didn't, we didn't yeah we didn't just, obviously didn't want to invite people over to have a look until they played the games, just so it didn't ruin anything for you guys. So it's a surprise. I know, I know you had uh, I know you had Luke um, playing earlier, but seriously, yeah. if this if this is not on stage, at, like whenever AGX is rescheduled for, yeah, whatever. Wait, if this is not on stage, I will be incredibly disappointed. Just like, oh, look at this custom content we've made for Animal Crossing. Like, you like, know, you know. <laughs> Do you guys know what Dal Dalla Shop was? Um, I know Dalla wasn't Nintendo, and he's now at the lovely Rare, yeah. who I also love as well. Yeah, Rare. I haven't played Sea of Thieves in so long. I'm so I get, upset. I get seasick, so I need to play more. <laughs> <laughs> Bad memories. Right, I'm going to have to jump out and, and sort out the next uh, five o'clock slot, guys. But thank you so much for playing. Have Thanks fun. a lot for and, having uh, us. Bye. Yeah, yeah good games. Bye. Bye -bye. It was so nice to meet all of you. Likewise. You. Oh, guys, <laughs> yeah. thank you so much. It was, it was wonderful and it was an honor. It was really nice to play against you. It was, it was um, lots of fun. And yeah, I felt now, very blessed. Because of all the clapping at the end, Isaac's just clapping. Oh, cute. <laughs> I'll follow you guys on yeah. Twitter and, and be in touch for some island shenanigans, but thank you. <laughs> See you later. See ya. Bye. 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 Hello, hello. I believe you all can hear me now. Here we are. Um, so <laughs> I guess I'll just give you all <laughs> uh, final, uh, finally saying hello because I hopped in. Yeah, okay, Animal Crossing Olympics, amazing, super fun, <laughs> um, really good time. Unfortunately, it, we got the time zones wrong. I don't know. Did the time change in Europe just like today or something? Because we thought we were going to be playing uh, pretty much like eight minutes from now. Um, instead of whatever time it is right now, uh, instead of like an hour ago. So we were an hour off. Um, so luckily we got a later time because I would not have been up for this. <laughs> I would have like probably barely woken up to see um, that this was going on. Um, Alex from Nintendo Life was playing in the, in the game before us. So... I okay. I'm trying. I'm gonna try to get his name right. Uh, but we got invited by. It's either Enel or I know Tomlinson, and he is apparently. Um, I'm going to his Twitter right now. But he contacted me on Twitter about joining this. 
but he's uh, his um, account says pronounced Enel or Inel. Um, he's an actor, comedian, voiceover artist, Twitch affiliate, voice of Comedy Central UK, and he's a, a works at Kinetic Comedy. Um, but yeah, uh, he's over in the UK. He was hosting this. Um, <clears throat> Alex was not in our round, um, <laughs> but it was another person who sounded a lot like Alex Ansley from Nintendo Life. <laughs> I, I was really hoping we'd play against him, uh, just so I could be like, hello there lovely people, welcome to Nintendo Life. <laughs> I love his little intro, it's great. Um, but they, uh, Inel Thompson, uh, Tomlinson, sorry, uh, he coordinated this whole thing and we had another little host there. She goes by Melly. Um, I forget. Let me see. She sent me a message as well. Um, I think it was Melanie Clark. Um, they were both the hosts for us on this island. It was really fun. Uh, <laughs> but let me see. What, what else can I say? Oh, yeah. So drama she kind of like stepped away for a bit because we all thought this was going to be happening like now like an hour from now so I actually was like getting on to stream for you all for like an hour before this whole thing went down but it started so unfortunately drama missed it um I got invited to do this by not only Anel but um Animal Crossing World Justin who runs the Animal Crossing World blog told me about it um and then we all got set up with our team here so he was like hey you me drama should do this and I was like yeah that'd be great so I, I joined their team <clears throat> we all played together so I'm gonna get some water we all played together and had a good time so uh, yeah I don't know it, it was really fun <laughs> I really like it I think I could definitely tell there was a bit of latency between this because I think we I got the go and I think on my screen, I saw that I had gone on time and was good, but on theirs, they saw they were ahead. So you'll kind of see that on the playback if you watch their um, Twitch channel. After this whole thing is done, I will have it updated with all the necessary links. Um, they, are, they are doing this for um, charity as well, so I'll post those links in there. But yeah, uh, just like, I don't know, being off the time zone, I had no idea what was going on. So. Um, I guess I'll give you all, I'll still hang out for a little while, I'll give you all a little tour of what my island's looking like, so I've got, um, it's getting a little bit overgrown here, I always pick these weeds and plant them again, just to put them back down another level, because I like to have them a little lower, but I've been, yeah, I've been going all out with this foresty theme, as you can see, I'll take you through it right now, so this, if you go left here, you'll actually head over to my to my house. Um, I'm still I'm still figuring out what I want to do with this front area. Um, I didn't even have time to open my mail or anything. I had a bunch of trees in my pockets. So I'll show you where I dropped those off, but for some reason I keep getting more trees. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> Hi Piplup. Thanks for joining. But yeah, this is my path to my house. I'm still kind of figuring out what I want to do for that exactly, but we've got another path that goes to the left here um, I want to put a little seat around here to make it uh, to kind of fulfill my little secret reading nook um, it looks like it looks like Eunice is here hanging out also these were our uniforms as you can see my character is all decked out um, drama made these uniforms for us she had her chat pick out our outfits and everything so it was fun so this takes you to this little beach area where Benedict lives. I really like this spot. It's one of the first areas, one of the only areas that I've decorated for a villager so far. So he's got a little fishing spot, a little bucket to keep his fish. Um, and then of course, if he washes his clothes, it's here. Oh, I forgot I got a few stars last night at Dramas as I was picking up outfits with her. Um, but yeah, I really, I've really enjoyed this little area. I think the house works perfectly in this little spot, so it's cute. Um, yeah, let me go up a bit more. The weeds definitely went crazy here in this little spot. <laughs> I'm keeping it that way because I love it. Um, over on this side, I, I'm gonna rearrange Pearl's home definitely. So let's actually go in and visit her, see if she is crafting anything. 
Thank you, Ivy. Love that pathway. It's pretty great. <laughs> Look at all those trees, Quantrell. Let me tell you. Oh yeah, she is crafting. I went to an island last night and it was... I wasn't planning on picking up any trees or anything, but uh, they had a lot of pine trees, so I was like, okay, I'll get more trees. So right before this, I was scrambling because I was trying my best to empty out my pockets, get over to their stream on time to hang out. And um, yeah, so they if you are still interested in the Animal Crossing Olympics, they're actually streaming. I will... Let me, let me post a link to that in the, the chat here. I'll have to open it up on my laptop because for some reason I'm not signed in on my PC. So I, I'm i not one of those PC versus Mac people. I have both. <laughs> um, I make a lot of content on my Mac and I only stream on the PC. So let me go over here to my live section. Hey, Katie, thanks for joining. Hey, I love your podcast. Thank you so much. <laughs> um, so I'm going to man it. Uh, yeah. All right. I'm going to drop a link here. If you want to watch the rest of the Animal Crossing Olympics, they're all going here. We still want to know why Pearl has a dog house. So Pearl, uh, you, you'll notice here she has a little bird house as well. So I actually wanted to give her a couple pets. Um, so everybody knows that cats are friendly creatures who love the earth. And they're not enemies of dogs, they're not enemies of birds, they love both. So that's what's up. Um, but yeah, there's the link for all of you if you want to watch more of the Animal Crossing Olympics. They're going on for, I think they still have three rounds to go, so you can watch. Um, it's pretty awesome. Uh, oh, I had no idea this was a funny tree. <laughs> I literally did not know. I just moved and put this tree there. That's crazy. Well, there we go. Oh, I guess I should show you this little section. So I made a little park here. Um, there's a, a log bench. Jackie gave this to me because I don't actually have the crafting recipe for this log yet. So she crafted me one. She put it here. I really love it. Um, over here, I have a little park bench. So just another little place to hang out. I still have to figure out what to do with the entrance and everything. But here, as you can tell, is one of the spots where I offloaded a bunch of pine trees that I got. Um, yeah, I offloaded these as well. All of these back here. Yeah, all of these pine trees were not here before. <laughs> I, I literally just put them there. Here's Benedict. Benedict lives over on that beach house, like I was telling you. He's really cute. I like him a lot. <laughs> Can't wait to hear what you think about all the new updates. Yeah, we're going to be recording all of that today. We've got some surprises in this next episode, so I hope you tune in. It should be pretty fun. It's going to be a really fun podcast for sure. Uh, I like to talk to all my villagers here. Um, so this one, I think I actually already know it. Yeah. But um, for Haken Islanders, be on the lookout today. I'm going to be posting the newsletter so you all can see what's been going on. I skipped last month, so I feel like there's a lot to catch you up on. A lot of changes that are coming, but a big surprise coming to the podcast this upcoming episode. So you'll be the first to hear about it there. Um, and then... On Tuesday, for all of you who aren't um, Haken Islanders over on Patreon, you will be able to hear what the new surprise is, so it should be pretty fun. Um, yeah, so yeah, this is my <laughs> new uh, pine tree forest, apparently. I've put a bunch there. I actually, I don't hate it. <laughs> I actually kind of like it. They might stay this way um, for the time being, uh, just because it feels like it works. So, yeah, I haven't really done anything about my intro, uh, my, my morning routine at least, so I'll do a bit of that with you all. The chickens are so cute. <laughs> yeah, the chickens are really cute. I'm, I'm a huge fan. They're some of my favorite characters for sure. Um, let's see. So Eunice we already talked to, but this is Agnes's place. We'll go ahead and check in on her real quick. Let's see. Uh, but yeah, uh, the, the Animal Crossing Olympics were really great. I'm actually seeing if the next round is starting soon. I think they are going to be starting soon. Um, so I won't stream too long because I do want to kind of watch the rest of it, see how they play out. But a lot of really awesome people are involved with it. Let me let me go take a look. Um, there, there was a schedule I retweeted recently. 
Um, okay, so according to the schedule we just went, before us was Alex from Nintendo Life. Up next is going to be Geeky Cassie and, oh, versus Inel, or Inel, I don't, I still don't know how to pronounce it. I should listen to him so he could, so I could hear it out, <laughs> um, but the host will be playing against them. And then we've got Kib Media, and after that, versus Rami Ismael. I don't, I don't know who that is, but they seem to be a bigger account, <laughs> a pretty huge um, following on Twitter there, so should be pretty cool. Pine Tree Islands are the best. I agree. They're, the, they're so great. What types of flowers and bushes did Leaf bring? Um, when he was over at my place, he actually brought the tea olives. So I had tea olives. Jackie had camellias, which I didn't actually stop by and pick some up. So there's one thing I really wanted to test. Oh, good. I was really scared because, you know, in the in the past, the bushes would just disappear if you dug them up, but it looks like you can transplant them, which is very important. <laughs> Look at how they shake. The leaves are so great. They're beautiful. Um, I went, uh, I got some hibiscus uh, bushes from Tab. And I think everybody right now has azaleas um, because they're in season. So they'll, they'll be ones that bloom. The tea olives, of course, did, uh, weren't bloomed there because I don't think they'll bloom until... Oh, is he eating... Oh, a sandwich. I thought he was going to be eating a slice of pizza here. But the tea olives won't bloom, I think, till autumn. That's what the, the... At least the olives, that's when they started blooming in... Um, new leaf, so I'm gonna assume that it's the same there. Um, but let me actually check my map because I don't know. Okay, so it doesn't look like Crazy Red is visiting today, so we'll go ahead and ignore that. But as you can see in the background here, my museum is getting <laughs> an upgrade, which should be pretty fun. I found Red yesterday on my island, and he sold me the starry painting, or the twilight painting, the twinkle painting? I think it was the twinkle painting. I don't know, maybe starry, but it, no, it was the, the twinkle painting, and it was the starry night um, painting, which is pretty great. <laughs> Um, nice, my hibiscus bushes aren't blooming yet. Those might be in the summer. Um, usually those are summer ones. So I haven't actually looked at the shop yet today. I think both of these are things I, I have, but this diner table is one that I don't. So I'm actually gonna buy that one. I really like having like this upgrade where we've got, oh, I should check off some things that I'm doing here. So nature day, plant hyacinth bulbs. Okay, so it's actually asking for like some specific flowers to plant. That's pretty interesting. The twilight painting, I love it. Oh, is that what it's called? Uh, I called it the twinkle one, didn't I? <laughs> um, all right, well yeah, the twilight painting. So yeah, this is cool. I, I didn't know we were gonna get like specific flowers that we'd have to make. How do you get hibiscus bushes, Chewy? Um, it really de uh, so Leaf will have different ones all the time. It really depends on what he's got in stock. He'll, he'll rotate his shop around, so you'll be able to get some different things like that. I really like this flower shovel. I might get it and put it somewhere as a decoration a little bit later. Maybe outside of one of my villager homes. I think that'll be cute. So let's see if we have red hyacinth. So we do have red hyacinths available in the shop, which is good. So it's not something that we'll have to like chase down and go to somebody else's island to buy or anything. So that's at least beneficial. I really love these blossoming walls, so I buy them in every color. Um, also, I don't know if I have this white delicate blooms wall. I think I do, but I can always use more. <laughs> Oh no, oh my gosh, no, it's called The Twinkle. I was just laughing at the idea of Twilight movie painting. Oh, okay. <laughs> Sorry, I did not want to leave the cabinet yet. I want to stay in there and check some other things. Okay, so yeah, it is The Twinkle painting. <laughs> Kitty, I think he should be back. Also, Nook will give you the hedge recipe if you go talk to him. Yes, go uh, complete one of these... Um, uh, nature day tasks. Um, as you can see in the Nook Miles, you have a nature day one every single day. Mine right now. It's a good one because it'll give me a thousand 
So yeah, it wants me to plant some hyacinth bulbs. Oh, so it's just hyacinths. It doesn't need to be red. It doesn't need to be any color, but I just go to red all the time because I like red a lot. <laughs> I'm actually going to look, and if I have white ones, I think I will plant those because I, I do have a lot of... Okay, so I do have some white ones. I'm going to buy five of them for now and do that little task. But I have a lot of red and I have a lot of yellow, but whites tend to be the ones I'm missing. But yeah, I hope you all had fun watching those Olympics. It was pretty cool. <laughs> Just gonna hang out with you all here for a little bit. Um, but I'm also probably gonna head off soon just because I woke up and I did this. I have to go make breakfast and things. Jackie's probably a little hungry, so I should make her something to eat. We're gonna put some hyacinth bulbs just all over here. All right, so we've done our nature day task. Let's get those. So I don't think anybody is visiting my place right now. No, nobody at the campsite. But I do like to check in over at um, the nook stop just to see what fences we've got in the making. Oh, also, I, I should show you the, what I'm working on on the campsite. I'm going to re rearrange things as you see right now. But I've moved my campsite forward. I've started building out a cliff back here. I'm going to put some trees and things. But I want to put like a little pond here. I'm probably going to shift this all to the left a tiny bit just to give it more room because I want to do some specific things like put a sign up right here or something else. I don't know quite yet. I have to move this tree to make it happen. Hi also. Welcome. Um, over back here, I'm kind of, I don't know, I, I don't know exactly what I'm doing, but I want to put like, you know, of course a secret entrance down here to um, this, but what I ran into was let me, let me climb up really quick. But what I ran into was I didn't have enough space to put like some trees and make it a little bit more hidden. So I think I'm actually going to build this river down just a tad more, but I have to move a couple trees to do it. But I'm gonna move it down a tad more so I can, cause I want trees along this whole place and they need like a three by three space. And so I'm kind of at that right now, but I need to move it down one more space so I can dig into this cliff one more space and then I can put a ramp and fit a tree a couple trees hopefully a couple if, if only one fits that's fine I'm okay with that but yeah I want to have like kind of a double ramp to go down there but at the same time like I'm already at my I, that'll put me at capacity with ramps let me show you my map real quick um, I really wish I could do nine ramps. Um, so if we look at my map real quick, I've got, um, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six ramps right now. And that next one, those, it, I put two there that would put me at eight, but I feel like I need a ramp over on that right side next to the campsite, kind of next to those homes. So I have like an easier way to get up there. So yeah, I don't know. I don't know what to do, is what I'm saying, because the ramps I do have are all pretty convenient right now. I don't really want to get rid of any of them. I, I like them all. I think they're all pretty helpful, beneficial for my island. I, I, I'll give you a little tour of them really quickly, but yeah, I don't know. I, I guess I'm, I'm at a loss here. I hope that one day we'd be able to put nine ramps but here's one that'll take us up to grizzly i mean the other option is of course like just omitting this ramp completely and trying to put it maybe closer to the center point here um but even then i, I just don't know where i would put it like this spot's already really tight there's a house here there's a house right next to the other one so yeah I'm, I'm having trouble with that, but we'll, we'll see what I decide, but as of right now, it's not looking like I'll have a ramp on this right side, and getting up here, I guess, I'm wondering how bothered I'll be having to get up here by walking 
all the way around either through the back or from that left side. So I'm kind of just wondering if I'll be annoyed by that because then the way up would be here. Let's, let's look at the map right here. So I'm, I'm acting as a marker. So my little spot right at that, that secret beach, that would be it. That would be like where I could get up from. And I'm not sure. I might have to carve in like another little secret path through the cliff or something, but I don't know. I think I'd av avoid that, honestly. But it might depend on like how I put some bridges, but yeah. Anyways, um, I've been streaming for a little while. Thank you all so much for tuning in for those Olympics. I hope you enjoyed them. I'm gonna watch some of the other rounds that are going on. And if you're seeing this later, I'm gonna try to have all the links for um, the hosts and everything, their Twitch channels where they're hosting everything. Um, of course, this was all for charity. If you all were listening, they were getting, so I'll, I'll try to get the link for that and put that in the description as well so you all can donate. Um, but yeah, I hope you're all doing great. I'm gonna go make some breakfast, hang out with Jackie for a little bit. And yeah, yeah, stay tuned for the podcast. It should be pretty fun. We're gonna, we're gonna do some cool things, but yeah. Uh, I'll figure out these ramps. I'll, I'll show you an update. This this place is coming along. I've got some crazy paths going through my island. As you can see, the bottom center corner of the map, well, I guess it's not a corner, but the bottom center of the map, like right exiting off of the airport, you can kind of see what I'm going for as far as like really wild, intricate pathing goes. It's not like too intricate, but I don't want it to be like just straight lines and stuff. I want it to go kind of crazy and everything so that you can kind of see that like around my home I've got like this weird looping path I'm gonna be putting some uh, some decorations around there I'm still like I said figuring out how I want to arrange the entrance to my home and figure out how I want that to be settled but it, it's coming along it's all it's all happening so it should be pretty cool but yeah thanks so much for tuning in I will talk to you all next time I'm gonna be working on some podcast stuff today and tomorrow and probably some other videos. Um, if you all watched my video recently kind of talking about, um, uh, let me look it up real quick. I essentially want to talk about Animal Crossing now that it's been a month and I had a lot of different subjects to talk about. So I want to start on the next one and the next one's probably going to be focused around, I actually have my list here. But I think it's going to focus around the crafting. Yes, the crafting is going to be the next thing I talk about. First thing I talked about was island development. And what I talked about there was just kind of like the beginning of the game, just getting to know the game and everything. Um, but yeah, the next is going to be crafting. And probably from there, I've got some other things like Nook Miles, events, um, features that are missing, uh, which I'm kind of glad I've waited now that some of them are coming back, so there's going to be some interesting things to say about that. Um, patches I want to talk about, um, play experience, um, but yeah, it's going to be like a huge long thing, so be on the lookout for those as they come out. I don't know how often they're going to come out. I'm, I'm kind of going away from like a bit of a schedule and just doing things as they're done, kind of focusing on making videos as good as I can get them um, and then put them out when they're ready versus like putting them out when they need to be out. So um, I'm going to be working on that. Yeah, I I've been going through a bit of an identity crisis with the channel, but it'll it's getting there. I'm going to make it something new, something different, but I'm just figuring out how to take it. But yeah, anyways, thank you all so much for tuning in. I will see you all next time. Bye.